Cillian Murphy has landed another thrilling role following his Oscar win earlier this month for portraying famed physicist J. Robert Oppenheimer in Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer. On Monday, it was announced that the 47-year-old Irish actor will star and produce the upcoming film Blood Runs Cold. The movie, based on the book Blood Runs Cold, The Yablonsky Murders and the Battle for the United Mine Workers of America by Marka Bradley, is set in the late 1960s in the coal mines of Pennsylvania, according to Deadline. It will follow one of the most infamous crimes in the history of organized labor and chronicle the life of a coal miner. Jacques Ablonsky, who advocated for better working conditions with the United Mine Workers after a mine explosion killed his father. Ultimately, Yablonsky was killed by Tony Boyle, who was convicted of conspiracy in the 1969 murder of Yablonsky and his wife and daughter. Murphy has been cast as Jock's surviving son, Chip Yablonsky, that made it his life mission to get justice for his father. Jez Butterworth and his brother John Henry Butterworth, who have co-written several screenplays together, including Edge of Tomorrow and Ford v. Ferrari, penned the script. Earlier this week, news broke that Murphy would be returning for the highly anticipated Peaky Blinders movie. The star, who played gangster Tommy Shelby in the BBC series which ended in 2022 will begin shooting later this year with the rest of the cast. Creator Stephen Knight shared the exciting news while speaking to Birmingham World at the premiere of his new BBC show This Town last Thursday. He said, he is definitely returning for it. We're shooting it in September just down the road in Digbeth. The movie is set to begin filming at Digbeth Lock Studios in Birmingham in September and will be set during the Second World War. Cillian had previously said of the project earlier this year, I have always said that if Knight delivers a script that I know he can deliver because he is such a phenomenal writer, I'll be there. If we want to watch 50-year-old Tommy Shelby, I will be there. Let's do it. Fans were thrilled with the news as they wrote in reaction, We are back. The goat is back. Glad to see him back in the role for the film. Should be good. I am so excited. This news made my day. Oh my, it's back. This is a must TBH. Wouldn't be the same without him. This gonna be massive. After his historic Oscars win for Best Actor for Oppenheimer last month, Cillian said of his character Tommy, I love playing him. He was exhausting and so wildly different for me that each time going back was kind of a journey. I'm really not sentimental about work. I feel like the next thing is the most exciting thing. And I mean, it was a 10-year period in my life, so it is significant. But I always feel like, let's keep moving. He previously said he would be happy to reprise his role. Speaking on Desert Island Discs, he admitted he was relieved when the BBC drama ended in 2022, but is now totally on board with the movie adaptation. Murphy also hinted that the program's writer, Stephen Knight, had more stories to tell about the Birmingham-based Shelby clan and their criminal activities between the 1880s and 1,910 seconds. Peaky Blinders launched in 2013 and garnered huge audiences both in Britain and overseas, attracting roles for silver screen stars such as Tom Hardy and Anya Taylor-Joy. Cillian was awarded the Oscar for Best Actor for his performance in Oppenheimer at the 96th Academy Awards in March. In his speech, Cillian told the star-studded room that he was a very proud Irishman standing here tonight before dedicating his win to peacemakers everywhere.